fantastic. And I came, had a wee word with him afterwards and they said to me, Scotty, we never miss your show, son. <laughs> Jack and Ricky, there we are. That was better for me than a knighthood. Far better. Um, so there we go. Yes, we loved Gordon Jackson. Uh, loved it when I am jolly said, hello, how's your week been? Then the best bit was when he said, I've had a bloody awful week. <laughs> Love it. <laughs> well, a minister was a tough gig. Ministers, priests, vicars, a very tough gig, actually. Saw a video of you yesterday, Scotty, talking about face masks, but you had no beard. Thought you'd shaved it off. No poly cost. This just grows and grows. I quite like it, and a lot of people seem to. Uh, Scotty, I love that TV show you've done, talking about being puffed out. Oh, the puffed out one. <laughs> oh, you puffed out. <laughs> there you are. Well, maybe have a look at that tonight, Eddie, actually, and see what's what. But I wanted to do a wee bit of chat with you about some stuff I've been doing here on... Um, oh, that's lovely. As somebody sent me a lovely picture of a chip shop in Oban. Yes, let me see if I can. There's your notifications coming for tonight. Wonderful stuff. Now, uh, you can follow Scotty McLean, of course, on Facebook. Very, very important. Get that sorted as well. So there we are. I don't know what's happened to that. I was going to have a look and see if I could uh, give you a wee bit of that. Ah, there we go. There we are. Now, that's that. So I'll tell you what was what was going on. It must have been from earlier in the year. Absolutely, Polycos, because this thing grows really quick. You know, I mean, I had it all shaved when I got my hair cut, and it grows really quick. I can tell you that for nothing. So there we are. We'll maybe have a wee look at that tonight. Oh, fantastic. So there we go. Now. Um, it must have been from earlier in the year, absolutely. Uh, now, here's the sort of stuff we get, yes. Um, yes, absolutely, absolutely. McLean has put his replies in. Um, so there we are. What have we got here? Yes, here's a guy calling for abolition, abolition of the monarchy. And somebody else goes, what's wrong with this country? Dying, hungry, jobless, mentally unstable. We support some who needs nothing, gets support. Time to wake up, smell the roses. So there you are. So this guy, just talking complete and utter nonsense. The jobless, the hungry, the food banks, that all is political, right? The monarchy are nothing to do with politics. So there you are. So I've told them, I think you misunderstand the contribution the monarchy makes. So there we are. Uh, and then some dafty comes back with some nonsense. So there we are. I'll just put a wee answer there. I'll just tell this person to grow up. There we are. There we go. Wonderful stuff. Right. So that's what we've been getting. Now, um, my mistake, it was about panic buying a toilet roll, says Paul. Ah, yes, that's right. I put that up. Thank you, Scotty. How are you? J-Dog has joined us. How fantastic is that? Wonderful, J-Dog. Excellent, excellent. And welcome, welcome. Now, let me see if I can find this for you. Right, I'll see if I can find this for you. And we can all have a wee look at that. Wonderful, so there we go. Uh, the bit that uh, that gentleman was talking about. How are you, Jay Dog? Are you all right? Um, so there, are. are you well? It's wonderful, this is what it's about. No, that's that. Oh, excellent. Right, so what we do. Uh, on to YouTube, so there you go. So these dafties not understanding anything about the royal family going on about, oh, they're so rich, they're so rich, all that. You get fed up with it. 